Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to the channel and today we're here with hospitality vr which i'm guessing is a hospital type vr horror experience but a ghost is going to be very nice and hospitable to us i'm guessing that's why it's the name uh we need to sit down for this one actually and i apparently don't need to use my joy cons and as you can see i'm controlling the dot with my face uh quality settings hi yes i'm sure that's good all right let's start oh uh, Wow, okay. Need to be very still for that. <laughs> I'm excited though, I like these, uh... Whoa! Holy shit! Oh, we're in a wheelchair! Okay, this is cool already, I like this. Oh, dude, this is gonna be like being in an amusement park ride, that's awesome! Oh, kind of scary though. Being seated really sells you in the immersion of that you're actually in a wheelchair. Especially because I have wheels on my chair. Uh-oh. Something is not right here. Which, I mean, come on, obviously. Look at this elevator. This looks like it hasn't been cleaned in, what, 200 years? Where are we going? This is very far down. Oh! I'm guessing this is our stop? Yeah! Sesame open? <laughs> you guys remember that scene from uh, Spongebob where Patrick th tries to open the door? And he's like, open sesame! I did everything I could. <laughs> Whoa, this is kind of sick. Dude. I, I I can't really explain how this feels, but it's so weird. If you don't own a VR, like on video, it probably looks like just any other game, right? But man, it actually feels like I'm here. That's so scary. Am I supposed to do something, or is it going to be doing stuff on its own? I hope it's going to be doing stuff on its own, like an amusement ride. Oh! Okay, so I'm guessing it will do stuff on its own. What the? Oh, no. Get me out of here! Roll out! <laughs> Oh man, hospitals are already scary enough, let alone with a demon haunting it. Uh, hello? <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. Hello? Oh! Great! Just- hey! That's my pal. What am I looking at? Is that a ghost going in- Going on a wheelchair? Damn, that's fucked up. Even in the afterlife of the ghost, you need one? I guess so. We're in the same boat, buddy. I think. Uh, well, maybe not. I think I'm very much still alive. But Oh. Can you stop that? Can, can you stop? No? Alright. Alright, Jesus. Alright, you can keep going. Okay, sorry. You can keep going. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck, that got me. <laughs> I was expecting the wheelchair to fly across the room. Holy shit. You done now? Thanks. You.
Right. Very normal stuff. What is that around the wheelchair? Just like an aura. I'd really like to get going now. It, it seems he's eager to leave as well. What floor are we on? The depths of hell? Probably. This elevator took us straight down to hell. Kinda rude to just leave. You kind of look like Darth Vader from here. <laughs> Is that just me? I think. <laughs> what? Okay. Sorry about the Darth Vader comment. I actually like Darth Vader. It was a compliment. Everything is a lot darker now, so I think we just... I'm guessing we look straight ahead instead of left and... Or maybe not. Okay, the lights are back on there now. What is happening? Just come out! Can't be that hard. I'd help you out, but I'm kind of in a wheelchair. Right. You don't need any help. You got it. My bad. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Door MVP. <laughs> Send that bitch back to the shadow realms. Holy shit. <laughs> I spoke too soon. I, I guess the shadow realm was coming for me as well. There's that aura again. What is that? Is it the the fog from Lost? Where are you going? You gonna resurrect that dead body? Seems like it. Yeah, I mean it's breathing now, so. They got dinosaurs down here too? What the hell kind of hospital? Ah. Right. Wait, can we close this door? I feel a lot safer with that door closed. Oh, hi, dude. Where are you going? Why, why are you going that way? Oh! Yo, ah, shit, I bumped my hand. <laughs> you're, you're looking lively, though. You look great. I mean, considering you were on the verge of... Did I just do that with my hand powers? <laughs> that was a good time. Oh, oh my god. Oh, I think I need to go to a real hospital. <laughs> Holy fuck. <laughs> oh, it scared the shit out of me. What are we looking at? A power outlet? What is this? A door. And we're back. I saw that this was a pretty short horror experience, but man, it, it's starting to feel like quite a long one already. <laughs> Not even a lot is happening, but I'm still on edge. Oh, come on. Is that a chainsaw? Don't. Don't bring me a chain. Oh, come on. Did there have to be a chainsaw guy? That's kind of dangerous, man. You should watch out. You might hurt someone. I'm guessing that's your point, huh? Yeah. It's gonna stand there and do... Jesus, that's bright. I wonder if we can use our head to, like, trigger stuff. Like in a menu.
Wait, am I crazy or are we, are we getting closer? Oh, just. Are we dead? I'm not sure. Is that is that the end? Is that it? Oh. All right, guys. Well, that was hospitality uh, VR. Pretty cool, short little experience. It was only like, it was only like two bucks, and there was already a sale on it. And I mean, two bucks for a ten, what, thirteen minute experience or something. Pretty pretty decent. I think it was ten minutes or something. But overall, pretty cool. It built up the atmosphere pretty nicely, I guess. But I feel like we were stuck in the same place for too long. And a lot of stuff could have been, like, improved to make it better. I was really hoping it was going to be, like, a haunted house kind of amusement park ride. Where we just sit in the wheelchair and we go through the hospital and there's stuff happening all around us, right? I was hoping that would be kind of the case. And I don't know, it, it would just be cooler to maybe add some mechanics. Like, in the in the main menu, you could, like, click select with your, well, well like your face pointing at the select button or start button and then you can start while looking at it and i think that would be kind of cool to use that as a mechanic in the game maybe i mean this is a vr horror experience it's not it's not supposed to be like a playable game obviously but i feel like a vr game with mechanics like that would be kind of cool a horror game and it would also be cool at the end where the guy with the chainsaw right it would be cool if you could be able to dodge him like moving your head so you can dodge him or something stuff like that would be kind of cool but yeah kind of kind of upset that it wasn't like an amusement park ride but i mean i still enjoyed it quite a bit uh, that, was, that was cool for what it was i guess but i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and uh if you liked please like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video peace